welcome to the best nighttime skincare routine ever. This will give you clear skin, glass skin, baby butt naked skin, smooth. First step, I have um, dry skin and oily combination skin, as people would call it. It is dry here, 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 but right here and here, T zone, T steak, T bone steak is very fucking oily. It's disgusting. If I use like a metal scraper on my nose, so much shit comes out. It looks like bullets. It's disgusting. So, to counter that, the very first step in my skincare routine is an oil cleanser. A newer heart leaf pork oil cleanser. What this does, it's not your normal cleanser. People think oil cleanser, oh, that's for girls who use makeup. I don't use makeup, I'm all natural. I'm naturally gorgeous. You can use an oil cleanser if you have, you get clogged pores and shit. If you have oily skin, and this helps with removing sunscreen. People do this wrong. You know, I've been seeing shit online. People say, a newer Harley, this shit is ass. This brand is ass. No, it's not. It's cause you got bad genetics, ugly. So to use an oil cleanser properly, you want dry hands, you want a dry face, you boop, boop. Dry hands, dry face. And after like 30 seconds of rubbing your face, you can feel, you can feel like the fucking dirt come out of your face. It's disgusting. But you're not done yet. This is crucial. Run your hands through the water. Not like maybe like in a second, like a. And when it looks like a male's production downstairs, you want to emulsify the oil cleanser on your face. What that means is basically just keep rubbing your face after you wet your hands. And then you're done. Second step. A foaming cleanser. A cleanser that foams. It's in the fucking name. I use focus you. I use this one. I don't know, my mom gave it to me. I don't question her. She's probably correct. You can have wet hands and your face is supposed to be wet. You wanna rub your hands and so emulsify it. When bubbles come out, that's when you start massaging your face. I do it very violently. I'm not gonna do it now, I already did it. I do everything in the shower. You know, efficiency, save time. And after you violently attack your face with your hands in circular motions for about a minute, 30 seconds, a minute, you run your face under, under cold or warm water. If you do hot water, it will dry out your fucking skin. I used to cleanse my face and have boiling hot water wash it off and I would come out the shower feeling like I'm in a Rango movie, feeling like I'm in a fucking desert. It's not good, don't do that. Third step, use a toner. This is what I use. Focus, cunt. Boom, booklet. My mom also recommended me this. I don't question her, she knows best. Now what this toner did is it toned my skin. Skin tone, I don't know what it does. I'm not a dermatologist, I'm not a dermatologist. Who cares? People use it, I use it, you should use it. That's it, that's all you need to know. Don't question it. Next up, second toner. I'm using Hado Labos. This is a Japanese product. This is a, a toner that also tones. This is different because it contains seven hydrolonic acids. No fucking idea what that means. I'm gonna assume it hydro, hydrates your skin. 
So, as so, same shit. Bombocrat! That product is apparently the golden, the golden product, the holy grail skincare product in Japan. And because it makes you glow, apparently. I believe it does. Is a fourth step or fifth step? This is my favorite product of all time. This has saved my skin. Without this, I would look like you guys. And that would not be good. Edging you. Bombo clad. Paul is choice. Paul is choice. Salicylic acid. This is a chemical exfoliant. This will give your skin the glow because it kills all the dead skin cells. It also unclogs and shrinks and large pores that's good for me i got pores smooths smooth and even skin tone lightweight liquid absorbs quickly efficiency you can use this with a with a, like a cotton pad i mean it says on the back you should use a cotton pad sad that's a robbery the cotton pad is stealing some of that so we're just gonna put on our hands about this much pop, 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 pop. a few little droplets a little quick rub and tap. Oh, probably don't put in your eyes. That's a terrible idea, but I just did. You know, this product, I know I said this before in a previous video, but on the back, it says to use it twice a day. So, what does a logical person do? A man of great academic achievement, a man of logistical, logical reasoning. I listen to the fucking product. So I would apply this morning and night and it was not good. My face was on fire. I, even if I put a little toner on, like I do a little droplet of my toner. <sighs> It, it burnt my face. My face was on fire. But at the time, I thought it was good because, what's this called again? Salicylic acid. And what does acid do? A man of my logical reasoning, I would assume this was doing his job. So whenever I put product on and it hurt, I was like, oh yeah, skincare. No, that's your skin barrier dying. Don't listen to that. I put it once a day though, because I don't know, it works for me in it. Do not pair this with a vitamin C. It, it hurts. You don't want to find out why. Have been Next step. I just recently bought this from Korea. Santella Ampule. No fucking clue what it does, man. I'm just gonna be honest with you. I searched up best skincare in Korea. This was at the top of the list. You put it after the exfoliator. It's good. I don't need to know what it does. final step wait till your skin is a little dry and then put this product so i'm gonna just chill here for a bit a little dance break now for the final product the holy grail in my skincare collection the second holy grail sicker balm 
B5 Plus from La Roche Pussy. You could use this as a moisturizer. You could use this as a repairing balm. You could use this as whatever. I don't use a moisturizer. This replaces it. Do not use too much of this though. Just use a generous amount. If you have too much, put on your neck. is all for the skincare video guys simple skincare routine simple enough but that is how you get the perfect skin that is all if you guys enjoyed that video please leave a comment and a like i'm gonna list the products in the description no i'm not can't be fucked someone can do it for me in the comments yeah have a good one